Economic and Financial Crimes Commission has reacted to the conviction of its chairman, Abdul Rashid Bawa. A statement by the head of media, Wilson Ujaren, said that the anti-graft agency received the verdict with shock. Ujaren noted that the judgment creates a wrong impression that its chairman was encouraging impunity. A spokesperson said that Bauer has been an apostle of rule of law, due process and collaboration between institutions in justice administration. The EFCC stressed that the FCT High Court order was given on November 21, 2018, three years before Bauer became the chairman. Ujaren said that the commission released the vehicle to the applicant on the 27th of June 2022 and approved the process to release the remaining 40 million naira. The statement confirmed that the EFCC had initiated a process to set aside the entire contempt proceedings and committal of Bauer for contempt.